Hey everybody, it is Friday. Happy Friday. It is 1.26 right now and I just finished my workout, but that's okay because I had errands and business things that had to be done this morning. So sometimes you have to take care of business, take care of things in your life before you can jump onto your workout. So today was double workout day. Every Friday with T25 is always two 25 minute workouts. So it was 50 minutes actually. <laughs> I'm still kind of breathing again because it was just, you know, it was, it was a workout. <laughs> I first did lower focus, which is always my most challenging workouts. Anything dealing with the legs, especially when they get into leg muscle burning, <laughs> that always is a huge, huge challenge for me, and today it was. Today was in the lower focus. The things that really got me was, you know, when you'd have to pulse up and down, and you're holding a position, and your thighs are just on fire. <laughs> that was, that was it was hard. It was rough, but it was good. I could feel it in my thighs. I could feel that I'm going to, you know, start toning up what I want to do. So that's a good thing. And then after I finished that, it was, of course, cardio. So cardio was awesome. It was a little, you know, after you've done 25 minutes, you're kind of a little winded and you're jumping to something else. But I love, I actually do prefer the longer workouts. It's always a time thing, you know, with, I think for everybody trying to fit in an hour workout seems to be a little bit more than you can do, especially, you know, it's one, almost 1.30. I have to get Eli at like two something. So I have to hurry, jump in the shower, get dressed really quick and go pick my son up at school. So, but cardio, one thing I did notice, of course, it's a lot of jumping. So if you have knee problems, that one is going to be something you're definitely going to have to modify. And even then, it still might be a little pressure on your knees, depending upon what your injury was or what your problem was, but there was a lot of jumping and cardio. So those are things that you're going to want to think of. If you had a C-section, again, the jumping, depending upon how far it's, you know, how long it's been since your C-section, are things you're definitely going to have to modify, but you should be able to make it through it. If you feel like you're having any problems, definitely stop what you're doing or find another way to modify. But it, it was a good workout. It felt great. It's a great way to dive into the weekend and start just kind of putting together other things that I have going on in my life. So anyways, kind of a short video. I could hear, hear Ellie kind of fussing in the background and I do have to get Eli soon. So awesome. Just letting you guys know that yes, I do these workouts daily. When I say I'm doing, I really do my workouts. Sweat and all. So anyways, you guys have a great afternoon and we will chat later. Bye.